there on the bottom side to push this Zeri lane in. And we're going to once again see the response here to the Talia. The Akali is what players like Closer like to play into this, even though the dashes and stuff like this can be very annoying. Same thing with LeBlanc. You can outmaneuver the, the Talia, and you can assassinate the Talia in team fights, and you burst damage as Willer. Yeah, uh, Delight is going to find it. What the heck? Delight does so much damage, as there's Chains of Corruption as well, and First Blood goes to Baze! Delight, man, he is all We're talking about that they're sitting on looking for Soul in just a moment's time. We'll see what that Soul is going to be. Yeah. Oh, it's Infernal. I mean, oh, God, bro, it doesn't matter. I got the cool dragons. Uh, as Willa is looking for this one, does find the Glacial Prison. Peanut going to be taken down. Closer collecting that kill as now Chovy arrives a little bit late. Fast enough. Got a little bit greedy. But does it affect the overall game state that much? Not really, because again, almost no damage has been done to these turrets. So this Herald isn't going to be that great for you as right now. Uh, into Genji, who are just feeling fantastic. Close are going to get caught though, and Doran was just standing ready to hit the Akali, but they didn't even need to. Live Sandbox have started off the Drake, but now they have to do it without their most fed member, as Peanut looks for Envy, and he will get him. There's a cease and desist, and oh, hi Chovy, welcome to the fight. Doesn't find the seismic shove though. As Genji now um, have Liv Sandbox in a very awkward position. Willow is trying to frontline, and Berta wants to get in here. But Genji are moving too fast and too far forward. They're too split, and Paze is going to get yet another one. Genji are just picking them apart one by one. Yeah, and, and where you, its weaknesses are, right? As you know, they, they wanted to fight for that Infernal, but it wasn't the right choice. They end up losing closer as well. That's a. Okay, that delayed. Yeah, Glacial Prison does come in, but the uh, Chains of Corruption will land, and that is the first bit of CC connecting, guys. And that meant a dead champion on the side of Liv Sandbox. Now they're going to hunt down Kyle. He's going to be the first one to fall, but Delight may go down, and no, Kyle survives. Genji will be able to kill it. Needs to get real skippy to try and get out of this one. Good luck. Yeah, in goes Peanut. Oh, what the heck? He kills him via reward? That's ludicrous. <laughs> well, sometimes it happens as uh, Closer is going to be able to backflip his way out. The uh, Piercing Arrow does a lot of work here. As Envy, he's gone rogue. Bounty he's going to be able to take a bounty in the mid lane. But Genji, they say, well, go for it. We'll take a Baron. Um, yeah. we'll see whether Liv Sambo can do anything about it. I don't think so. There's still two minutes on this Drake as well. I mean, Genji uh, just this taking any. actually takes him out for Kyle here. And Closer is just locked down all of that season. Speaking of lockdown, well, Pina um, has ult. Yeah, Peanut and Koza are going to say hi to one another. Ooh, good avoidance there, as Perfect Execution's going to come in. Koza, I believe, there did not have his Shroud available, but does now. And Doran's going to come through, and that is a very dead Akali. Just no way that he can operate in a side lane at this state of the game. And this is what we were afraid of at the very beginning, and it is now just coming to fruit whichever way they see fit with an infernal soul to boot. Yeah, and Rod is completed. We were talking about the timing of this working out so incredibly well for the soul fight. Not that he really needed that spike to be hit because he's just been doing so much on his own already. It's a very low kill uh, game for Chovy, but it's doing cool. so much value. Envy moment. I don't know about that as Chains of Corruption are going to lock down the Lulu. Pays almost one shots him, but he might have to use his flash. He does so. Closer on the flank. Can Pays be taken down here? Cease and assist, and Pays is the one that actually gets the kill. Was it a bait the whole time? I don't think so. But still, Pays is going to live, and Liv Sandbox are not. That's a double kill. Oh my god, does he get the triple? Yes, he does. Maybe he gets a penter after being the one to bait the play. The fact that Akali just cannot survive if she's point click CC'd. Yeah. And she just instantly deleted. I hope we don't see any more Akali in this series, to be honest with you, Atlas. As, uh, it's not a closer problem, it's a unofficial problem. Penta? Unofficial Penta? Unofficial Penta? Unofficial Penta? Unofficial Penta? It's the unofficial Penta angle! Kyle, give it to him! No. No, it's only Morgan that gives Pentas. <laughs> Kyle's not going to give that one away, as it is going to be, theoretically, the unofficial uh, quadra kill, therefore pays in the end. Gen G, just a pretty stock standard start-to-finish uh, game for them, but yeah. they played it.